friends, I'm Akash and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to show you a very interesting technique to multiply any two numbers together. This is called the Egyptian method and it works as long as you know how to double and have any number. So, let's go. Let's start by trying to figure out what, say, 18 times 23 is. The first step is to repeatedly have the number on the left until you get one. So 18 halved will become nine, and then nine halved would normally become 4.5, but just forget about the remainder, forget about the 0.5, so all you're going to do is just write four there, and then four halved will be two, and then two halved will be one. Now we've reached one. Next, we just repeatedly double the number on the right, which here is 23. So 23 doubled would become 46, and that doubled would be 92, and 92 doubled would be 184, and finally 184 doubled is 368. Now, we cross out any row in our table, sort of, where the number on the left is even. So that would mean cross out 18 and 23. Yes, the actual multiplication does count. Then we cross out four and 92, and then we cross out two, will be 184. And now, all you have to do is add the remaining numbers on the right together. So we have 46 plus 368, which is 414. And there's your answer. 18 times 23 is 414. This is a great trick that will help you whenever you need it. It's wonderful and very interesting indeed. All right, I really, really love this trick, so why don't we do another one? What is 17 times 24? Let's find out. Step one, repeatedly have the number on the left until you get one. So here we have 17. 17 halved is 8.5, but just forget about the remainder. Just write eight there. So that's just eight. Now we have eight halved will be four, and then we have four halved would be two, and then two halved would be one. So we've reached one. Right, so now we have to double the number on the right, which in this case is 24. So, 24 doubled is 48, and then 48 doubled is 96, 96 doubled is 192, and finally, 192 doubled is 384. So now, we cross out any row where the number on the left is even. So that means we cross out every row except 17 and 24, and then one and 384. Those two will stay. Everything else gets crossed out. So now we add the numbers on the right together. This is really easy. So all we have to do now is just 24 plus 384. 24 plus 384 is 408. And there you go. That's literally the answer. 17 times 24 is equal to 408. All right, this is going great so far. So why don't we do one more, shall we? So let's see, what is 19 times 30? Let's find out. All right, step one, repeatedly have the number on the left, ignoring remainders until you get one. So 19 half would be 9.5, but forget about the remainders. It's going to be written as nine and then nine halved would be 4.5, again there, but forget about the 0.5, it's four. And then four halved would be two, and then two halved would be one. And there we have, there's the one. So next, we repeatedly double the number on the right, which in this case is 30. 30 doubled is 60, 60 doubled is 120, 120 is 240, and 240 doubled is 480. So now, we cross out any row starting with the even number. So that means we cross out 
4 and 120, and then 2 and 240. We cross those out. Now, we add up the remaining numbers on the right. So that's adding up 30, 60, and 480. 30 plus 60 plus 480 is equal to 570. And surprise, that's the answer. 19 times 30 is equal to 570. I really, really love this trick. When I first saw this, I was like, wow, that is amazing. Like, it's really interesting because this isn't your typical multiplication, let me tell you. This isn't your typical multiplication. This is wonderful, I love it. It's a really easy trick. So now you know the Egyptian method to multiply any two numbers together as long as you know how to double and halve easily. So now, in order to enhance your knowledge of this trick, let's do some homework. Find out what 14 times 27, 15 times 24, 18 times 21, and 13 times 31 are. I know you're gonna get it right. Oh, and if you want to check if you're right, then of course, the answers are right in the description below. And that's about it for this math video on how to multiply two numbers together with the Egyptian method of multiplication. Thanks so much for watching this video. If you like my videos, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon so you don't miss my new videos every time I upload. Once again, thanks so much for watching. Love you, Akash.